back with a brand new video and today for this video we are going to be unboxing a Beyblade Burst Turbo Slingshock double pack. Sorry guys, trying to get into the light better. Anywho, we have a double pack for the Slingshock. Hold on. Okay, yeah, we have we have Thorn X Minaboros M4 and Crash Rock Devour R4. So let's just look at the stats real quick and we'll unbox it. Yeah, we have... You have the energy layer, Thorn X Minaboros, uh, we have the disc, which is zero, and we have the driver, which I believe was, ne was it Nito? I'm not sure. Then we have the stats here for, uh, Slingshot, uh, we have the speed, four, and the, what? And the power, two. So, yeah, just make sure you all see that. And then the actual stats for the bay are attack, four, or, hold on. Come on, focus. Okay, attack, four, weight, seven. Burst 4, Defense 4, Agility 2, and Stamina 0. Okay, well now let's get on to the main day of this pack, which is Crash Rock the Bar R4. This seems like folks. Okay. Energy Lair Rock the Roar, uh, Disc is 11. To be honest though, 11, it was supposed to come with a frame, so I don't get why Hasbro didn't put a frame on Rock the Roar. Anywho, then we have the driver, which is Wedge, which S that is. And then we have the stats for the for wedge, which would be uh, hold on, hold on, power five, speed one. Okay, then we have the stats, which is attack four, burst two, defense two, weight six, agility one, and stamina nine. So this thing's got a lot of stamina. So I don't think there's anything else. We have Crash Rock right here, and I'm pretty sure normally with the gimmick they're supposed to have the wings coming out right here, but I think don't think that's gonna be there. So let's just go ahead and open this. Oh, we got the directions right here. Let me just see if there's anything different. Nope, nothing really different except for the slingshot gimmick. And it's telling, yeah, it's telling you how we. Hold on, hold on, guys. I gotta zoom out. Accident. We zoomed in. Yeah, it's telling you guys how to switch the, how you uh, switch the driver to slingshot mode and battle ring mode. And move that out the way. Focus camera. Alright, let's get the bays out. Uh, let's get Minaboros out first. Come on. Okay, yeah, we have the lair for Minaboros. Hold on. Yeah, there we go. The lair for Minaboros, and here's the code if you want it. Then we have the uh, zero disc. I've actually already got a couple of these. Yeah, oops. Hold on. Yeah, I've actually already got a couple of these, like with Surprise and Rec Realm. And then we have the Nito, I believe. Let me just try to switch it to slingshot mode. Oh, wait, there it goes. There you go, now it's in slingshot mode. It was in battle ring mode before, now it's in slingshot mode. It's pretty cool. Now let's just go ahead and put it together and see how the slopes feel. Oh yeah, Tiana, speaking of this Minaboros, I kind of like this one better than the original Minaboros. I just like the green emerald design. Kind of reminds me of Rayquaza a little bit. Eh, I guess the slopes, are, they're not the best slopes in the world, but I guess they're okay. But anyhow, that's how it looks put together. Oops. Okay, now on to Rock Devour, the main events. Okay, as you can see, we got Wedge. That that's in its battle ring mode. Uh, hold on. What? How do you switch it? Oh wait, man! I, I think I got it. Okay, guys, it looks like you push these little tabs in on the side. Yeah, you push these little tabs in on the side, it looks like. Yeah, I think that's it. Hold on, let me look at the instructions. Okay, guys, back. My Sorry, my storage cut out. But yeah, I guess it's in slingshot mode now. But anywho, we got the 11 disc, pretty standard. Now on to the layer itself. Okay, here we have Crash Rock Devour. I kind of, I really like this layer actually, guys. 
I mean, I've never been that much of a fan of the Rock and Roll line, but I have always liked, they have always had great layer designs, sorry. But yeah, and like I said, the gimmick does not work with the wings. Yeah, the gimmick does not work with the wings. Oh yeah, and here's the QR code if you want it. But yeah, no metal on it, of course, like the, all the Turbo Bays. Uh, there's still an insert spot for the level chip, but let's just go ahead and put it together and see how the slopes feel. Uh, not the best slopes. Yeah, not the best slopes. So it's kind of like the origin original Crash Ragnarok. But yeah, guys, I guess that's going to end it for this video. I just wanted to give a quick unboxing. I will be doing some more battles with this video in the future. But for right now, leave a like, subscribe, and share. See ya.